Evan the same. A Sirevarana hit. Me volt hocht en geherd vir. Me vertruv het an Belengrik. Vise den ib kiseret. Net en verb tene. Het en krisa. Do you know what this is? I know. Who it is? Triss Marigold. No. Until recently, advisor to King Foltus. Artifact compression. Complicated spell. Is she alive? Her life processes are on hold. But it is reversible. Though, very difficult. You created a portal between Loch Muin and Nilfgaard. You should manage the figurine. Stand back. I cannot be sure how her body will react to decompression. No pentagrams, candles, spilt blood. It figures you do know little about magic, Ambassador. It matters not. We need her alive, Asira. Make sure her body survives decompression well. I'll do what I can. But she will be disoriented for some time. What is your name? Oh. Tell me your name. Tress. Wie se ke toch gedein. Wie se es spät ep wovret. Dar toch ep nedling der hier. Me hen a venes ep turin. Me perft in alverde. Oh my god. You crazy bastard. Marigold. Your name is Triss Marigold.
disease did, and the climate. Long ago, the sources of the Pontard did not freeze over and flowed all year. Flowers still... Knights of the Flaming Rose at a peace summit. I wonder whose side they're on. On that of whoever paid them. They've made camp outside the city walls. It means they're not here in an official capacity. Are they on vacation? Maybe they just don't want to stand out. Eilhart has a dragon up her sleeve. Radovid has invited a unit of the Order's knights. Don't forget Sheila and Henselt. It should be an interesting peace summit. Any idea who might have summoned them? Radovid. Now the scum of the Order wear the Redanian coat of arms as they burn pyres. Witch hunts are their favorite pastime. Or so I've heard. Radovid witnessed what the Order did in Vizima. He saw the Grand Master's madness with his own eyes. Yet he gave them a new home. For a good reason, I expect. That's easy. He needed a whip against Eilhart. You shouldn't let them see you. I know. To them, a good elf is a dead elf. It's not because you're an elf. It's because you're Yorbeth. I'll try to enter the city through the caves. I advise you to do the same. The knights will know I'm wanted. You know of a passage? I know of a cave nearby. There are many ways to enter Loch Mui, my friend. If Radovid has summoned the Order, I'm certain the others have brought their armies as well. The city must be full of soldiers. All of them sitting as if on a witch's bomb, waiting for a spark. But that may be to our advantage. If the rulers have holed themselves up in camps, it should be easy to move about between them. Let's go before we get noticed. Uh, no, I think a full Yorath is better. Valley on the other side. Once a team with wildlife, it's now dead. The royal delegations arrived here. I know. I 
that's why we went around. What exactly killed the Vrands? As the years went by and the climate turned colder, the Vrands had less and less food. That's where they encountered the first human settlers and their flip. We're in love with me. We're on the fringes somewhere. We should find or nearer the main court. Let's go. Oh, what's that guy dead on the floor? That does not look good at all. Bothered your vest then. Gag Philippa in the nick of time, and she almost cast a spell. Rotting in the Redanian dungeon now, in special shackles. Radovid's right to show the witches their place. I wonder what they'll do to her. Either the execution or the monsters will have their fun. They say Logmoin's dungeons are full of scum of all kinds. No idea what they locked her up for, but every sorceress is guilty of something. True enough. Not likely to see anyone weeping for her. A dungeon befits Philippa Eilhart very well, though gallows would be even better. If they kill her, you can forget about healing Saskia. They must guard her as heavily as the Emperor's bedchamber. We'll not get in there. I'm in no hurry to visit the Emperor's bedchamber, but we've got to get into the dungeon. Look for a passage through the sewers. I'll locate Eilhart's quarters. If she didn't expect to be arrested, I may find something interesting there. I can think of a quicker way into the dungeon than the sewers. I just need to get arrested. They'll take your weapons and put you in shackles. Though there is some chance you'll wind up in Philippa's cell. I'll manage. Wandering through the tunnels would take too much time. Let's go then. I'll find Philippa. You search her quarters. Right. We learned a lot the last time we browsed through her things. Va fail, Gwynblade.
What are you doing here? I worked awfully hard to see Philippa Eilhart in chains. I doubt you'll be so witty once we're standing side by side on the scaffold. Unlike you, I've done nothing that would get me hanged. To them, you're a Kingslayer. I assure you, Radovid's torturers will make you admit to anything. Even intercourse with trolls. Did you know from the start that Saskia was a dragon? I had suspected she was not what she seemed to be for some time. Though I did not learn the truth until she fell poisoned and I could examine her thoroughly. I've seen the list of antidote ingredients. Not a word about the Rose of Remembrance. Well, we all prefer to have loyal allies. The Rose of Remembrance is very powerful. Even as a she-dragon, Saskia could not resist my spell. Why don't you summon her? You could use some help now. Dimeritium blocks all magic, telepathy included. Someone's coming. Your Majesty. I've waited long for this meeting. You left Redania so suddenly I had no chance to give you the send-off you so richly deserved. Your Majesty. I fail dun, dun, dun. to understand why I have been arrested. I've done nothing but serve Redania's interests. Supporting the Rebellion, undermining Hensolt, risking my own reputation on your behalf. I'm no longer the little boy who believed your every word. Why do you do this, Radovid? I was there at your most trying hours. Without me, you would not be the man you are. I don't understand. You understand very well. You conspired against my father, Vizimir, and against me. The entire Redanian court once trembled in fear of Philippa Eilhart. Untrue, sire. You must let me explain. What are your charges, your majesty? Ambassador. Triss Merigold was kind enough to compile a list of persons making up the secret society known as the Lodge of Sorceresses. Some Nilfgaardian sorceresses were members as well, but you need not be bothered with them, my lady. Triss, you're mad! The Lodge ordered Demaven killed. It ordered Baltes killed. I suspect you played a part in my father's death. And if I released you from the Dimeritium, you'd kill me too. You're finished, Eilhart. There will be a trial, due process. Everything as it should be. But know that you shall not wriggle out of this. You shall be convicted of conspiracy, treason, and regicide. They'll rip your flesh from you in bits before they burn you at the stake. Throughout my childhood, I felt your cold stare on the back of my neck. When I issued orders, my subjects would search with their eyes for Philippa Eilhart's gesture of consent. The entire court at Tretagor looked on as you humiliated me. All Redania laughed behind my back. You taught me to look everyone in the eye. Forced them to lower their gaze, do you remember? A king must never show weakness, uncertainty, you said. I've mastered that skill. Yet there is one I could never force to submit. You. You've one chance to shorten your suffering. Admit to everything, here and now, in the ambassador's presence. Look me in the eye and repent. Submit. As you wish. Torturer, put out those vile eyes. You're making a grave error, sire. Talk again, witch. I refused to believe it when they told me Geralt of Rivia was in my dungeon. The Geralt I know wouldn't let himself be captured. I was really hankering for a tour of your dungeon, sire. What's so interesting about it? The guests. I apologize for the dismal company you're in, witch. Eh? Fortunately, Eilhart won't be with us much longer. I beg your mercy, not for myself, but for Triss Marigold. 
Your friend is now in Ambassador Fitz Estelin's hands. I know. But surely Shillard won't deny you a small favor, sire. Forgive me, but I can't be sure that I won't require grander favors from Nilfgaard. The fate of entire nations will be decided in this city. Individuals are irrelevant. The Nilfgaardian ambassador mentioned an organization of sorceresses. Just so happens I'm interested in the plans of this lodge. Those plans should interest no one, because the lodge will soon cease to exist. I've nothing against you personally, Witcher, but you've gone from being an uninvited guest to being an awkward witness. I understand I'm in for an extended tour. You certainly shan't leave here before the summit ends. I'm flattered, sire, but you overestimate me if you think I could influence it in any way. Politics is like a complicated puzzle. Every piece may prove useful. Or equally useless, even harmful. A breakthrough awaits us here at Loch Muin. By my hand, no less. This will be no second, Thaned. Soon, everyone will learn what the Redanian King is capable of. You'll excuse me. But it's time for the summit. Radovid is capable, but too young. He has yet to understand that only the dead remain truly silent. Because Redania is doing Nilfgaard a favor, I feel obliged to help the king in return. What favor do you mean? You can tell me. Just like you said, the dead keep their secrets. That's true, but I prefer to be cautious. I promise to reveal every last detail as soon as your body is cold. Did you would live to see it. Loch Muin's in for a huge surprise, both the mages and the kings. Nobody likes others to decide for them. That's especially true of kings. You're dangerous, Witcher. You're too independent. In time, Radovid will thank me, and he won't be alone. Kill him, but beware his sorcery. Hold him, heart. Of here. I need some answers first. Clock's ticking. Time is of the essence. Why do you do this? Would you take vengeance on a blind woman? Shillard said they've got Triss. I have to free her before they put out her eyes, too. Going to the Nilfgaardian camp is suicide. And leaving a friend is villainy. Only I know how to break the spell that holds Saskia. Get me out of here. If I die, she'll remain forever spellbound. All right, but if you're lying to me... Unbind me and lead the way. We must return through the sewers. The shackles stay on, and you'll go first. Shillard will raise the alarm. No, he won't. We'll be long gone by the time he comes to. Kill him. I'm not into murdering unconscious old men. Lead on. Oh, I would. I want to get out of here. I want to live. Sure you won't faint on me? I'll manage. Will you remove my shackles? Oh no, not a bug again. Why am I stuck? Ah, I can't move. Okay, in that case, I think it's telling me I should go to bed. So, good night, guys, and see you later.